Hello, today I want to show you how to draw a football. First, we're going to start with an oval. Come through here and just draw a very large oval. And this will be the start of our football. What I'm doing right now is just drawing this line in, this shape of an oval, to allow for a guideline so I know whereabouts this football will be placed on my piece of paper. Now I have this large egg, which will be a football. Next, we're going to divide it in half. Now, we want to make sure that we actually take a line that we're going to draw and curve it. If you notice, this line is curved. It creates form. It really allows for the contour. It's actually a contour line to show us the form of this football. You can see how it curves. Now we need to bring in the laces. Now the laces, I'm just going to come in here and we're going to give this football five laces. And I'm just drawing in guidelines, once again, to allow, allow for space to make sure I have this, have enough room for these laces. Now I want to go ahead and go right around these laces and square off each of the edges. Again, this, these lines that we drew earlier are just guidelines. Now I'm just giving flesh to these lines, making them a little bit thicker. I'm making rectangles. Now these rectangles are curved. If you notice, these rectangles are all curved in the direction of our point of view. Our point of view is really important. If you know where your point of view is, then it's easy to create things three-dimensionally. So we have, right now, all these laces in here. We need to bring in the middle lace. And once again, it's just going to be a large, long rectangle that's going to be curved. Let's come through here and just erase all these guidelines I do not need anymore. That's why it's important to draw very lightly. We can easily erase those guidelines. And then we're left with a football with laces. I'm coming through and just darkening all these lines. I'll come through here and just darken up this part of the football. So we have a football that's more three-dimensional. Let's go ahead and give this football a shadow. Come right through here and make a oval. And it gets very close to this football because this football is closer here than it is over here. And we'll just go ahead and shade this in. It allows our football to pop off the page. And that is how we draw a football.